Assalamu alaikum friends. Today we will be continuing our Tasil series. Lesson number 9 Prophethood. Rasulullah began to spend more time in the cave of Hira. One night, while he was in the cave of Hira, Allah Ta'ala sent the angel Sayyidina Jabrail alayhi salam. Sayyidina Jabrail alayhi salam ordered him to stand and read. Rasulullah said, I do not know how to read. Sayyidina Jabrail alayhi salam repeated, read. The third time, Sayyidina Jabrail alayhi salam asked him to read in the name of your Lord who created man out of a claw of blood. Read, and your Lord is the most generous who taught the use of the pen. He taught man what he did not know. Rasulullah sallam, on hearing this, became afraid and returned home. He told his wife Sayyidatina Khadija radiallahu anha what had happened. Sayyidatina Khadija radiallahu anha replied, You help the poor, you look after the needy, and you do many other good deeds, and so Allah Ta'ala will always help you. Sayyidatina Khadija radiallahu anha then went to his, her cousin Waraka bin Nawfal with Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and told him what happened. When he heard this, he said, This was the same message that was given to Sayyidina Musa alayhi salam. Lesson number 10. Preaching After Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam's experience in the cave, Allah Ta'ala's message continued to come and Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam quietly began to preach the oneness of Allah Ta'ala to his family and friends. His wife Sayyidatina Khadija radiallahu anha was the first to accept Islam. His very close friend Sayyidina Abu Bakr and Sayyidina Zaid alayhi wa sallam and his cousin Sayyidina Ali and then Sayyidina Uthman bin Affan Sayyidina Talha bin Ubaidullah, Sayyidina Zubair bin Awam, Sayyidina Sa'ad bin Abi Waqas, and Sayyidina Abdurrahman bin Auf alayhi wasalam, became Muslims. Islam continued in secret for three years. Then Allah Ta'ala commanded Rasulullah wasalam, to preach Islam openly to his people. Obeying the commands of Allah Ta'ala, Muhammad wasalam, called his people together from the family of Quraysh and invited them to Islam. The people of the Quraysh were very angry at his teaching. Rasulullah did not stop preaching Islam although the people of Mecca were against his message. But the good people accepted Islam. The poor and weak converts to Islam, like Sayyidina Bilal radiallahu anhu. Jazakallah, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Follow the Sunnah, follow the Sunnah, inshallah we will go to Jannah.